Young Lawrence has proven to be quite a timid young man. Um, we weren't able to put him back with his family as originally planned, quite simply because they didn't want him there. They've become a very tight-knit unit with the little mini ex-stallion as the head honcho. And quite simply, they were very aggressive towards him and he didn't fight back. So we decided to move him into our walkway. Um, he settled down there very, very well. And then we thought, well, hang on a minute, let's put Sirius in also. Sirius has COPD, which is a respiratory problem, so we have to feed him separately. He can't have anything uh, with dust in it. And he also um, has to have medication every day to keep his airways open. Um, which works very, very well for him. Sirius is also round about 28, 29 years old. A very, very, very kind old horse. Well, there you go. This has worked out absolutely super. These two very, very gentle horses have bonded almost straight away. And I suspect they're gonna be very, very good friends. Sirius is already asking Lawrence to groom him. Um, I suspect this is the first time Lawrence has ever been asked to engage in a mutual friendship thing, which he's now doing. Isn't this absolutely super? I'm so, so pleased about this. So I think we're going to work a system out where these two can be together. We're going to have to separate them feed times um, because, as I say, because of um, the COPD uh, that Sirius has, it's important that he doesn't have dust and obviously young Lawrence needs an extra lot of alfalfa to build him up even more. But there we are. Do you know, that's a funny thing. It's a bit like a jigsaw puzzle here. Um, every one of them, they all have to fit in somewhere, but you just have to find that little piece, that little gap where that piece of the jigsaw fits. Sometimes you get it right first time and it's where you think it's going to go, but quite often, it's somewhere completely different but we are so so happy to have young Lawrence here and I'm so so happy that Sirius now has a bestie also to spend his days with. I love happy endings, don't you?